Hi everybody, my name is Hilary Booth and I'm a naturopathic doctor and welcome to my video blog. Today I'm going to be talking about B12 injections, but before I get going with that, I just want to remind you that I am still offering free seminars or lunch and learns to small groups and offices in the GTA. So if you're interested in that, please send me a message on Facebook or through my website um, and you can, or you can contact our office and I'd be happy to set that up with you. So, as we're heading into the winter months, I'm looking outside right now and it's dreary and it's gross and um, I start to notice people coming into my practice and they're experiencing low energy and low mood. Um, and this is something that can have a lot of different causes, but I want to really focus in on what B12 is and how that might be related to, uh, to low energy and low mood. So, uh, vitamin B12 is um, something called cobalamin, and that's a nutrient that your body can't produce on its own, so we get it through our diets, and typically we get it through um, eating shellfish, like mussels and clams, um, and some seafood, like salmon, and we also get it through um, beef and eggs, are sort of our top sources. So if you're a vegetarian or a vegan, you're likely deficient in B12, and you should consider getting that tested, and consider taking a supplement or getting injections. So, um, B12 is really, really useful in the body. It's used for pretty much um, almost any function that you can think of. It's used to make red blood cells to circulate oxygen around your body. It's used to convert your food into energy. It's used to build your immune system up for your white blood cells. And it's uh, used for your mood and for your brain function, for making your DNA. I could go on and on. It's used for lots and lots of little things. So. Lots of people though are deficient in B12 and they're not functioning optimally and then they get all these other different vague symptoms come up. So oftentimes doing B12 injections is a really great and simple way to see whether or not that makes a big difference in your life. So um, people who benefit from B12 injections um, if you're over 50 years old and um, if you are really stressed out uh, you probably will benefit from B12 injections. If you have, um, if you're on proton pump inhibitors or if you have heartburn, you take antacids, that can affect the absorption of B12 into your body. Again, if you're vegetarian or vegan. And also there's something called pernicious anemia. And pernicious anemia is basically you're not producing something called intrinsic factor, which is needed in order for your body to absorb B12. And so some people, this is a genetic thing, and people who have pernicious anemia do need to get it in the injection form in order to best absorb the B12 into their body. Um, also, people who are experiencing um, muscle weakness, fatigue, depression, mood swings. Uh, if you have poor circulation, you get sort of numb or tingling fingers and toes. Um, if you have poor memory, if you're um, seeming that you have the onset of dementia or Alzheimer's, um, and if you feel like you have brain fog, these are all things that can be caused by B12 deficiency or to say, or insufficiency. Because sometimes you have enough, but it's just not enough for your body to be fo to be working at the level that we want it to be working at, which is obviously at its most optimal state. So I'm gonna give you my top five reasons that I think that B12 injections are absolutely amazing. I love using them in my practice. I love using them on myself. Um, there's something that um, can really, really give you a lot of benefits. So number one is energy production. So I talked a little bit about this, but I'll explain it a little bit more. So um, B12 is essential for your body to take glucose or fat or protein and convert it into ATP. Um, if you remember back to high school, you learned about the Krebs cycle and about glycolysis and all these things and um, electron transport chain, all these things actually require B12 in order to um, keep those enzymes working properly in that chain of reactions and in order to actually um, make your energy. So if you have a low energy, if you feel like you're not as peppy as you used to be, if you're feeling like um, even with you know a good night's sleep and good diet, you're still feeling sluggish and low, you may have a deficiency in B12. Now, um, you can get the injection and it's a great way to just boost that energy right up. You actually feel quite um, elated the day that you get that injection for a couple days after that. Um, so it's a really great way to get an energy boost. 
My second uh, reason that I love B12 injections is for stress management. So a lot of people are under stress and it can take an emotional toll on our bodies and a physical toll on our bodies. Now, B12 helps us to cope with stress by balancing our brain chemistry. It actually helps to balance our brain hormones like dopamine, for example. It also sharpens your cognitive abilities and I'm gonna talk about that in a second. And it also improves our memory. memory. Uh, again, I'm gonna talk about that in a minute. Um, Another way that it helps you cope with stress is that it mitigates your cortisol levels in your body, which is your stress hormone, and it also works on a physical level with your stress in order to detoxify your body. So your body experiences stress, whether it be um, from toxins like from chemicals or food that we um, ate to emotional stresses to um, having anxiety. Those kinds of stresses are all perceived by the body in a similar way. So if we can reduce the amount of stress in different ways across our body system, for example, by detoxing pathways more appropriately, by uh, exercising regularly, that kind of thing, we can reduce the overall amount of stress that we're experiencing in our lives and help us to be able to cope with those other little things like um, things that may come up in the workplace or in your relationship that you may need some extra help coping with. Um, if you're sort of at your wit's end, you're not going to be able to cope with those very well. So B12 works to do something we call methylation, and that's a detoxification pathway that's very important in the body to just take off that level of stress um, on that physical level and help you be able to cope on other levels a little bit better. So my next um, way that I love B12 injections, a reason I love B12 injections, is that it boosts your mood. So B12 is necessary for the production of something called your monoamine transmitters. And those basically are in your brain, and if you um, have a deficiency in those transmitters, you actually may be experiencing depression or low mood. Now, if you get the B12 at an adequate level, your body is able to produce those transmitters at um, an adequate amount, and then you won't be experiencing that depression. It sounds so simple, but it's often not tested. So uh, research is showing that you can actually um, do B12 injections or take it orally, and that can actually prevent the need to go on antidepressants for some people. This isn't for everybody. Please do not go off your antidepressants unsupervised without a healthcare professional, uh, but it may be something to consider for you. And my next, my fourth tip or reason that I love B12 injections is that it improves your memory. Research is showing that um, Actually, people with early onset or late onset dementia, both of those kinds of dementia, may actually be a B12 deficiency that's being overlooked. Now, um, if you remember back to when I talked about the symptoms of B12 deficiencies, some of them are memory loss and reduced cognitive ability, that brain fog, and also some mood swings, which are common in people with dementia and Alzheimer's. So if you're experiencing memory loss, you may want to consider getting B12 tested and um, to do injections, and that way it should... Um, mitigate some of these factors and it's not necessarily that you're experiencing a true Alzheimer's process. However, the research is showing that if you don't catch it early enough and treat it early enough, that progression can go further than the point of B12 injections are able to help. So that's, a, again, something if there's some someone in your life who is starting to experience some memory issues that they maybe want to get that tested before it goes too far. Now my fifth and final reason why I love B12 injections is that it balances your hormones. So B12 is necessary for the breakdown of estrogen in the body. And a lot of us have too much estrogen going on in our bodies. And I feel like there are some jokes there that you know guys can make, but anyway. Um, and it can cause a lot of different problems. So it can cause irregular periods, it can cause mood swings, it can cause migraines. Um, it can also cause infertility. So um, for people who have uh, infertility, oftentimes B12 is something that's overlooked and it really should be looked at first. So it's used basically, again, to break down estrogen in the body so that it can be excreted from the body properly. And if you don't have enough B12, then you're not going to be excreting estrogen and there's going to be too much of it circulating around. And you're going to get things like lack of ovulation. You're going to get uh, difficulties with implanting the embryo into the uterus if you're trying for pregnancy. And you're going to get difficulties with maintaining your pregnancy. Now, another thing that low B12 can cause along those lines is hypercoagulability. 
I said that in the first try. And um, basically that's a cause of recurrent miscarriage. So again, if this is something that you're experiencing or you know someone who is, I would encourage you or encourage them to get some testing done and that could be a very simple solution to a huge problem that people are faced with. So I'm gonna give you a recap. My top five reasons for um, B12 injections are energy production, stress management, boosting your mood, improving your memory, and balancing your hormones. Uh, we, do, uh, clinic, we do testing at our clinic for B12 deficiencies. We can order that blood test for you, and I do recommend regular monitoring about once a year. And if you do decide with your naturopathic doctor or your medical doctor that you do need B12 injections, we offer them here at the clinic. So feel free to book an appointment and I'd be happy to go through that with you. Or you can contact the office um, at the number on our Facebook page or by going through my website at hillarybooth.com or drshawnandaroo.com for more information about that. So I hope you enjoyed watching this and I hope you learned something and um, I wish everybody a good week. Take care.